Jacques Marc, Jacques Marc, James Marcus or Marc Prévost was a British army officer of French Swiss origin. After being commissioned in Europe, he commanded troops of the British Army in North America and the West Indies, including during the French and Indian War, the North American Front of the Seven Years' War. Prévost was recalled to service during the American Revolutionary War, when he served briefly as British Governor of Georgia in 1778 after the British occupied Savannah. He also served more than once in the West Indies and died in Jamaica of wounds suffered earlier in the war. Early Life Prévost was born in 1736 in French-speaking Switzerland to a family originating in Savoy. He had eight siblings including elder brothers Augustin and Jacques Prévost. The two elder brothers both served in the army of the King of Sardinia, who then ruled the Dutch Republic. Seven Years' War Jacques Marcus appears to have joined his two brothers in the military in the Netherlands. They were recruited and commissioned as officers by Great Britain for its new Royal American Regiment. Augustin received the rank of Major Jacques as a colonel and Jacques Marcus as a captain. In the Thirteen Colonies, Britain recruited German and Swiss immigrant settlers as soldiers for the regiment after General Benjamin Braddock's defeat in 1755 in Western Pennsylvania in the French and Indian Wars. Britain was threatened by war with France as part of the Seven Years' War in Europe. The three Prévost brothers were sent as officers to North America in 1756. Jacques Marc was wounded at the Battle of Carillon in New York in 1758. Augustin was also seriously wounded that year while serving with General James Wolfe's army near Quebec. The two Prévost brothers recuperated in New York City. Augustin served further with the Royal American Regiment, especially in the Caribbean, rising to Lieutenant Colonel. After recovery, in 1761 Jacques Marcus traveled with Henry Bouquet, a Swiss colonel in the Royal American Regiment, to set up the British post at Presque Isle. They intended to deter French troops at Fort Niagara. Prévost was next assigned to command a body of troops in New York City. After Britain defeated France and military activity was reduced, he was put on half pay, marriage and family. While in New York City convalescing, Jacques Marc had met Theodosia Stilwell Bartow. They married in Trinity Church in 1763 after the end of the war. They had five children together, including Augustine, James Frederick Prévost and John Bartow Prévost. His widow Theodosia Bartow Prévost formed a relationship with the ten years younger American politician Aaron Burr and married him in 1782. They had two children together, but only their daughter Theodosia survived to adulthood. Northwest Wars Prévost's next assignment was to command a detachment of Bouquet's force at Fort Loudoun on the Pennsylvania frontier. He fought against Native American forces in the Muskingum River Valley of present-day Ohio, returning to Theodosia in New York in 1765. Prévost went back on to half pay for several years. After his unit was posted to the West Indies in 1772, he returned to New York in 1773. By then the couple had moved to their Hohokus, New Jersey residence, called the Hermitage, American War of Independence. At the outbreak of the American War of Independence, Prévost was a lieutenant colonel living in Paramus, New Jersey. After the British captured Savannah in December 1778, he was briefly assigned as British Governor of Georgia in succession to Archibald Campbell, sent with troops to Jamaica to put down an uprising in 1781. He died there that year of wounds suffered earlier in the war.